the portrait problem. The children in Mrs. May class were painting. They had to a portrait. I want to you all all painting someone's face," said Mrs. May. First, I will explain how to do it. Mrs. May draw an oval face. He draw three lines across across it, and put one line down the middle. The eyes are halfway down. The top of the ears are level with the ears. She said, "Chip was good at painting. He had painted a." Portrait of Anina. It brilliant, said Nadine. It do. It looks just like Anina. Mrs. May put the finished portrait on the wall. Mine is rubbish. Complained Wilf. No, it's not, said Biff. You just haven't got the ears quite right. Chip had a scratch book. He had to darn a scratch of Mrs. May. He quite good, smiled Mrs. May. To get even better, you need to practice. Try to draw as often as you can. So, Will Fan and Dean want to play with Chip. Chip's scratch book was in Biff's room. He had done a scratch of Nadine. I like to be an artist when I grow up," said Chip. "I will keep this," said Nadine, "in case you become a famous artist one day." Suddenly, the magic key began to glow. The magic took the children on a new adventure. The magic took the children back in time to a city in East East of. Florence. I wonder where the key will brought us. Here, said Chip. Just then, he heard a shout. A man was open a ma- window. He was shouting at the some man in the street. But sir, called one of the men, your picture is too big to down the stairs. We could knock the staircase down," said another man. "But why not to cut six inches of one and the painting? Impossible!" yelled the man. "I'm sure those children have more sense than you." He pointed at Wilf, Chip, and Nadine. "Children," he shouted. "I'm Sandal, Parkes, the Addis." Come up to my studio and tell me which and to cut off my picture. It was. It had taken me two years to paint it. The picture is called Spring," said Sandal. "Do you like it?" Chip gasped. "It's a famous painting," he whispered. I have seen it in a book. Nadine was looking at the window. There's no need to take the staircase down, he said. Knock out the window from and lower the painting into the street. Ha!、Huh, said Sandal. Clap his hand. Bow, bubble. The children often knows best. You want to be an artist too? Sandal asked. Look at Chip's drawing. You need to work hard and draw all the time. You must look and study what you say. See, I'm painting a 
Portrait of Young Man. Sandal went on. I want to you help me put on this clothes, so I can calmly to fill in it. Suddenly there was a loud, company noise. The house began to shake. The jar and pots began to rattle. Some fell on the floor with a crash. He sent us. Clark gasped. Tip, ah,、oh, said Sandal, I cannot walk like this. The man next door was a river. His room take the wall shake. The next go next door. Please, Basim, to stop taking my house. Sandal, please. He will not listen to me, but maybe he will listen to you. The lever came to the door. Your room was shaking the house of the sandal artist," said the man. Said Nadim, "He cannot paint in his pictures." The lever showed them his room. I. Leave fine clothes," he said. "It is how I earn my leave, and in my own house I can do what I please." Sando, the artist, painting beautiful pictures. The painting fine. Portraits and sad chip. That is his job. But leaving clothes is a popular job," said the lever. What did he see? Asked Sandal. In his own house, he can do as he pleases. Said Elf. So said Sandal. I need to teach him a lesson. Wait here. Later, Sandal returned with some men, workmen. They had ropes and long, thin poles of wood. On the cart was an enormous stone. Stone. The The man built a strong farm. Then they put the bowser onto the edge of the sandal's roof, placed it on the very edge. Sandal added, "It doesn't look very safe," said Wolf. Sando wrapped his hands. No, it's not safe," he said. He will see what happens when the lever room starts to working. The lever room began to shake. Sando's house is enormous. Stone shook well. Then it began to move. What are you doing? cried the Lever, the stone will as if move it. I will fall on my house. It will crash through my roof. He he shouted. Well, said Sando, in my own house, I can do what I please. The Nim had an idea. He spoke to the lever. Guy, the artist painting. A portrait of you wear a cloak of your fancy clothes. Rich people will see it and want to buy from you. Why not work at different time? The name added. Then you will both be happy.
The two men shook his hands. The river. Agree. The work in the morning. The artist agreed to work in the afternoon. That is clever, Nadine," said Wolf. Sandra began to began the portrait of Lever at once. He gave Chip a. One of his sketch, sketch. Then the magic key began to glow. It is funny when the stone on the roof began to shake. Laughed Wolf. I wonder if the portraits of the devil will be in the book I saw in the school," said Chip. It is really good portrait," said Mrs. May. "Did you draw it? No." Sandal Sandal Bautist did," said Chip. "Very funny, Chip," said Mrs. May.